Hello and welcome. I'm Alex from Royal Chevrolet Cadillac and today we have my 2002 Chevrolet Camaro SS and I want to go over a commonly asked question I get. How do you remove the T-tops? Let's talk about that. <laughs> tops in your Camaro the first place you're going to start is the trunk because if you're unfamiliar with these they are stored in the vehicle themselves so you're going to start with the trunk you're going to want to either use your key fob or use a trunk button that's located inside and you can go like this to, like you're going to go unlock it here very easily and it goes up now in the trunk here you do have this little panel here you want to make sure this panel is flipped out of the way and then you see two individual slots here both of them are located here and they actually have the written side of which one. So you can see over here, it shows driver side and over here, it shows passenger side. So it's very easy to know which slot is designed for which roof. So if you're wondering where they go, it's very simple. And the Camaro has it very easily labeled there for you. So when you're removing your T-tops, you are always going to start onto the driver side here. The reason is the driver's side is the first one to go in. So how do you take it off? First step is to grab it from the outside and use this latch underneath here. This latch is located right here on the pillar. You're going to unlock it like so. And then you're going to grab it from this position right here and lift it up. Once it's lifted up, you can see here that you have both sides. You're going to grab it from either side. And it's simple to do. You're going to make sure you leave the center line of it right here, you can see that this is secured underneath there. So you're going to leave it like that, you're going to grab it from either side like so, and then you're going to walk it over very simply. Once you get it here, I like to put it down right here. Now this is a simple one person job. So all you have to do again is you're going to grab it here, you're going to move it here. I sometimes like to lay it here if you're, if you're a little less comfortable with doing this. And then I like to grab it and simply put it down into the first position here and you can see here it simply fits in there you're going to grab the latch here and use that same latch to resecure it into place and now your first t-top is secured now i'll show you the passenger side so we're going to repeat the process on this side so all we're going to do is we're going to grab the latch from underneath here as well release it grab it on either side and then we're going to walk it back over to the back And again, I like to lay it down here for a second, resecure myself because we have to put it into this way. And we're going to then lean it down in the, the second position here. And then we're going to use that same latch, lock it into place. And there you go. That's how you put both your T-tops in there. So after your T-tops have been properly stowed away, they should be in the trunk just like this. So once you're done and you want to put your T-tops back on, all you have to do is simply reverse the process. All you have to do is put your hands down here, release the latch like so, grab it from either side, and bring it up. So after you have your T-top, you're going to simply take it from this position here and simply lower it down so that the lip is below the center line right here. And simply in, you make sure it's nice and level here grab the latch from below, and then you are going to just lock it in place, and you're gonna give it a quick tug to make sure that it's not moving. And as you can see this, it is secured, it is in place. There is a way to fully lock it though, if you really want to. There is a keyhole in the actual T-top itself, which you can use, which I'll show you here in a second. Uh, and then you could do that as well for uh, securing the T-top even further. So the way these are designed, you're always gonna start the passenger side first, and you're going to end on the driver's side and vice versa obviously for putting it on you're going to start the driver's side you're going to do that same process again you're going to level it as you just see here below that lip here and simply get it in place and you're going to relock the driver's side just like you did on the passenger side and give it a quick tug again and make sure that this is not moving so i'm going to show you from underneath how to release the handle all you have to do is unlock it like so and push up when you want to get it out 
And again, you're going to re-secure it like that. And as I mentioned, there is a lock. So you're going to take your keys. You have two on the Camaro here and a fob. But you're going to use this key, shaped like this. And you're going to simply put it in to the lock like this. And you could secure it like that if you want it locked in place. It even says this is locked in case you're wondering what this is for. And this is fully secured into place. And again, if you want to repeat the process, put the key back in. And again, use that latch to unlock it. And there you go. So now your T-tops are off. All you gotta do is take her out for a drive. Again, I'm Alex from Ocean of Lake Cadillac. Make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe to see more. See ya.